One of the most commonly asked beginner questions that I find on online bulletins, such as Reddit and other YouTube forums, is what is the best free video editing software? And every single time I have the same answer, HitFilm Express. Let me tell you why. I have used many video editing software in the past. These include Windows Movie Maker, Sony Vegas Pro, now known as Vegas Pro, Sony Movie Studio, Premiere Pro, HitFilm, and Final Cut Pro. Currently, my main editor is Final Cut Pro 10. However, for the price, which is zero dollars, it's free. HitFilm Express totally blew me away and I am not being paid to say this. Actually, this video is not in any way endorsed. I'm just talking about a software that helped me out through a time where I couldn't afford anything else. So here are the pros of HitFilm Express. It has a very similar interface to Adobe Premiere Pro. Actually, it almost seems like a knockoff. However, the layout is pretty standard. But more importantly, what this means is the skills that you learn in HitFilm Express, they are transferable to a lot of other editing software out there. This means once you get started in HitFilm Express, you don't have to stick with it for the rest of your career. This is the biggest reason as to why I recommend HitFilm Express every single time. It's available on both Windows and Mac OS. I used the Windows version. I actually haven't tried the Mac OS version yet, but I'm going to assume it's pretty good too. If you have any experience with it, please let me know in the comments section below. It has all the basic features to get you started and then some. Cut, create multiple video tracks, audio tracks, adjust the speed, reverse, transitions, video transformations, etc. It pretty much has everything that you would ask for in a basic video editing software. But then it has some advanced features too. Video effects, color correction, masks, and motion tracking. You can actually develop Adobe After Effects skills within HitFilm. It's like two software in one. Now let's talk about the cons. The performance is subpar. Software like Adobe Premiere are fast because they usually have a custom engine or something like that. I don't know, I read that on a forum somewhere. To my understanding, HitFilm uses OpenGL, so it's not terribly well optimized, but it will get the job done. That is, at least, if your PC meets the minimum requirements. Premiere Pro is significantly faster, and Final Cut Pro X just runs laps around HitFilm. It can also crash sometimes, and this introduces a little bit of unreliability. However, I still haven't found an editing software that doesn't crash from time to time. Just make sure that you're saving your project every few actions, and you shouldn't have much of a problem, other than a slight inconvenience. But for small scale and even potentially large projects, like a YouTube channel, I personally believe in HitFilm as a very good beginner and even advanced editing software. In fact, you might like it so much that you decide to stay within the HitFilm ecosystem. Before ending the video, I'm going to also mention two alternative options. We have DaVinci Resolve, which is free, and then we have Sony Movie Studio, which is sub $100. So let me know, what editing software do you use? Also, if you have any questions about HitFilm Express, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. I check them all the time and I did have like a whole year's worth of editing experience within HitFilm Express. All right, that is it for this video. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Okay, that video was from two weeks ago. I am on a bit of a hiatus, planning to figure stuff out again soon. Next week, I'm going to be making a video about this. Very excited for this. Check back for the 360 camera review.